you definitely don't want to miss his uploads because you're going to be missing out on some content if you do. And just, yeah, make sure to look them up. Anyways, looks like we're now getting back into the next set, which is Concert versus Orpheus, which is going to be Rob on side of Orpheus and Concert playing Mega Man. Both these two um, classic characters for them. Both pretty familiar faces in the scene. Imagine we're definitely going to... Both these players, I know, are willing to play a little bit slower if necessary. And knowing this matchup, it probably is. That's just the way these catches are designed. You don't hate the players. Um, but yeah, so imagine once again. Mega Man with the pellets are definitely going to try to find a way to zone out uh, Rob. Rob is going to have to find a way to use his um, aerials to get in. Especially when your main aerial is Nair, which is a relatively slow aerial on startup. You can definitely struggle to approach. And Fair can only do so much in some spaces. And we see these Pelters are really adding up for uh, adding up for Concert here. But Orpheus gets one hit and dealing, dealing a pretty decent amount of damage. And these projectiles definitely, while well, useful, useful, definitely be blocked out or negated at times just due to general startup on some of them. As we see there, Gyro being just hit back by a pellet. And I, know, I do know that Gyro is speed based, so depending on the speed, it depends on how how much he decides to charge it. That's how he can get around. Uh, Orpheus can get around these pellets. Yeah, the metal blade out being able to combo into the back air and above right now. Meg trying to land a Meg land against Mega Man is its own mini game. It's incredibly hard just due to his general tools with up air, and if you choose wrong, you can eat a back air. And now we're just seeing a we just saw a fair and a fair and the up air. Just definitely 46%, which you don't want to take if you're Orpheus. You really need to find a way to take the stock. And in situations like this where you can struggle to find the kill, taking this much damage is not good for you. Concert having Orpheus on ledge. DI good DI, avoiding any follow-up option really that uh, Concert could do. Concert trying to find Yuzi's down tilt to try to maybe get poke his way in. He's trying to get once again, trying to get Orpheus above him. That's side B. Gonna go punish with an up air and trying to punish the landing, but eating an air for it. Alright, it's right now once again. Oh, Con uh, Orpheus is lapped in percent by Consort. And he finally no smash after a fair and shield is gonna take the stock. But you're at a really high percent, your shield is low, and your DI is not not great. That's going to be the second stock going away of Concert. No, no, I don't think any percent built up on Concert before losing the stock. But at the ledge right now, this could be what Orpheus needs. Again, we know Rob, a lot of the gyro things, a lot of the gyro tricks, a lot of the gyro combos. He can, he can kill anyone from anywhere at zero, it seems like. It's not undoable, but Orpheus having to find control of the gyro to do that. And he's not being given the chance to. And nor is he simply trying to go out of his way to get them. This the amount of pressure that Contour is putting on with all these projectiles. It's not what you can do. And that back air. Really good at ledge. Very fast. Both be safe. It's not going to take it. But that down air will. Big body on the... Big body from Raw. He's obviously great for getting around this projectile based moves. You see it there in that down air, it's going to spike to take game one. I want to, I do imagine a lot of the similar stages that can work out for either of these characters are pretty good for uh, the other. They both benefit off generally larger stages to move around projectiles. Uh, platforms can either help or negate both these characters. Looks like, I think it's, is that Lilac? That, no, it's not, just, it's just Star Fox music. And this battlefield makes sense, once again. You like, if you're uh, Rob, you like the platforms to help mix up, uh, help punish recoveries and mix up your own. Uh, especially, but if you're Mega Man, you can also kind of do the same thing. They, they benefit your, uh, they benefit your projectiles as well to help cover more options to get around. And the bigger blast zones though for, I think you're blast zones for these, both these characters. Um, if you're 
you die loot you die later off the top. That's, I don't know the side blast ones relative to PS2. But I think it's about the same. But it, surviving that uh surviving that metal blade in the back here. And this pressure and this pressure is too much. Rob out of gas there and definitely something you don't see particularly too often. The amount of pressure provided there. So able to take that stock. I think we'll take that stock pretty, um, not pretty early, but a pretty solid percent from what Rob can live to. Yeah, mention the amount of pressure you can get stuck on the platforms. It can work for both these characters, but with the lead that lead that concert has, it seems to be benefiting him a lot more. With Orpheus having them, having them, well, seeming to be more of the aggressor, but concert once again knowing that his character has to play in a certain range and using Gyro against him. And these projectiles from counter and just a lot of this pressure with these back airs and a lot of these disjointed moves is helping really helping him out as Orpheus can't find a way to get in or use um actually any good landing options. Yeah, both these characters can definitely Definitely punish the other, but we're, we're seeing this more from Morpheus. Um, getting punished by Consort. Just in this general big body, and the platform is allowing um, Consort to honestly trap him in more situations. Consort is waiting for a lot of these options from Morpheus because a lot of Morpheus can't really do much. Unable to keep. Um, being behind so much, you're unable to really keep someone out. Oh, that's just a great off-stage interaction from Consort. Not to, not not able to take all his gas, letting him back on the stage. But that could definitely have resulted in Sock being taken early if Consort continued the edge guard. And it's off-stage right now. It's not looking great. Just getting hit by an F smash right now. If you're Orpheus, you're trying to find a way to land on the stage. Because once again, it's a struggle. If, especially with the way. Oh, he's out of gas. Yo. Oh, making it back. Unable to get the back air. Um, oh, jumping into the blast zone. It seems carrying the momentum from Gyro. From the Gyro hit. And right now, Orpheus, once again, 131%. 100, yeah, 131. He's gonna die to an up smash there. Not much you can do. Concert pairing the Nair and just up smash being a really good out of field option from Mega Man. That's gonna take the game. 